Uh, no, it feels good. I haven't played in two weeks now, uh, so I'm ready to get back playing. Um, I think the course looks great and I really like it here. I've played here a lot of times and I feel like I know the course well and I'm excited to get going, yeah. And, and like you say, you played this course a number of times. You finished tie third at the Jabber Open uh, earlier this year. Like, like it's a course that you seem to you seem to know yeah. how to play well. Yeah, exactly. I think it's a course that you you have to play a few times. I think to l to learn the breaks on the greens and where you not to be and what what position you want to avoid. Um, and I kind of figured it out through the years. I think yeah, it's been a good year for us overall. We've had uh, a lot of uh, these players come over and play on our tour a few times this year um, so it's been fun and now we have the best in the world which is great and it's and just good to be here with them yeah, <laughs> yeah. and like, so you played 2017 yeah. and like, like so you've got that experience already and mm. just like, like tell us about when you played it then like five years yeah, ago yeah yeah no that was a, a bit different because it was my first major and it felt very overwhelming i would say um didn't play that well and Obviously, it was a lot of rain that year. Uh, the first day actually got cancelled, so uh, we only had three rounds. <laughs> uh, so it was a bit different, but uh, uh, I, I feel more ready now, if you put it like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah definitely. <laughs> and like you say, you feel ready. Like, what, what do you expect of yourself from? Um, I just expect to play m the game that I've been playing all year. Really, like I've been a very solid year for me, and I hope I can just keep doing what I'm doing um, and if I if I miss on the right sides <laughs> of the pins and if I hold some pots I know I can I can have a pretty late tea time on Sunday uh, but uh, we'll see what happens yeah sort of right yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, and like obviously you had your two weeks off you're obviously in the bag with Alex last mm. week like have you had time to, to work on anything in particular um well it's been good actually because I was planning on playing last week uh, and then Alex qualified for the Open which was great and I really wanted to be there for him um, which gave me some time away again and we could work a bit more on the swing uh, between his rounds and <laughs> and that um, so overall I think it's been really good um, and it feels like the swing is in a good mm. place now so yeah, yeah, no, and I'm. And does that get like having the two weeks away? Does it get you in a good mindset? Like because it's busy, summer coming up. Yeah, now, yeah, like, exactly. You must be, like more focused now. Yeah, no, we have a couple of really big events coming up. Um, obviously, with the Evian, Scottish and British, and um, yeah, I'm ready to go. And then I might play a bit less later in the season because I feel like I've I've really played. <laughs> bit too much but <laughs> but it's been good of course but yeah yeah and, and like when you have these yeah you know, big event big event big event mm. like back to back does that yeah. help you like to focus like week in week out it must like really help you to to get your game where you want it to yeah be. well hopefully <laughs> and i think so uh, but also it's it's nice to knowing evian being the first of the three that you have more chances coming up mm. even if this week doesn't go like you want it to um so I think that makes you a bit calmer as well. It's not just one big event and that's it. Yeah. But we have quite a few now. So hopefully I can just play my way into it, yeah. <laughs>